We clear. Okay, we, we clear. Wait, wait, wait. We clear side rooms first, and then we clear. Yeah. Okay. Oh, sh that is the boss. Oh. <laughs> oh, Dextrin. Oh, oh, and it feared me. It feared me. It feared me. Oh no! Oh no! 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 Yeah. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Get out, it's a run angle. Run, run, get out, get out, run, get out, get out. Run, get out. Oh, no. Oh, I'm feared. Oh, my gosh, this is so bad. Oh, I think I have to leave you. No, 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 we're good. I dropped dummy, I dropped dummy. Ah, oh, come on, let me take me. Oh, I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go. I gotta go. Oh, please, 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 I'm almost out, I'm almost out, I'm almost out. Hey everyone, today I wanted to talk about the WoW Classic Hardcore servers and why they've changed the MMO genre forever. Don't worry, we will get back to whether I lived or died in that dungeon a little bit later. Spoilers. Phew! Now that that's off my chest, we can really get into the meat of this video. Listen, uh, I'll be the first to admit that as a retail WoW player and modern Gen Z gamer, WoW Classic was not something I found myself particularly drawn to on its initial release. Graphics are well this, whatever this is. Gameplay is slow and unengaging, especially early on. I mean, you're basically AFK until like level 10 or something, when you finally have your complex two button rotation and casting wrath three times runs you completely out of mana. And then you just gotta go back to bonking the mob with a staff as a caster. I think it's safe to assume this game is not for me. Then Blizzard released hardcore classic servers and suddenly I was interested. Not because I believed that classic would be fun to play, but because the challenge intrigued me. When I was a young teenager, I played a ton of ultra hardcore Minecraft, which is basically a battle royale game mode with no passive health regen. Every decision was final. I loved it so much because it made me feel like I was the main character in a book or something. It provoked emotions in me that other games or game modes did not, and death meant something. Not in the way that it means something in other games, but it's finality, it's the end of the line, the end of my connection with that storyline. With that desire for story and a meaningful experience, I decided that I needed to understand what the hype was about. I wanted a challenge. Despite my newfound interest, I was not about to play alone, so a few friends and I decided to try it out together. We formed a uh, fellowship, if you will. You shall be the Fellowship of the Ring. Right. Where are we going? Alright, the name is Yolo Xersis. Yolo Xersis? Why? Because <laughs> Hunzi was unavailable, bro. <laughs> so who, who took the name Hunzi, man? When I made my first character on Classic Hardcore, I almost instantly felt a bond with him. Like, okay, buddy, we're actually doing this. Just me and you. I don't know, maybe I have attachment issues or something, but I was committed. Oh my gosh, why does this take so long to open? <laughs> Bro, wait till you get the crap some sh it takes like three minutes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly. Very early on, I had some frighteningly close calls that really got my blood pumping. Oh, fudge. I'm, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No, you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Wait, start running. Start running. Start running. Get oh. out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> Bro. Oh, new dagger just dropped. <laughs> We're so up. <laughs> Panic, adrenaline, fear, excitement, accomplishment. I felt all of these within my first few levels and I was hooked. I was deeply immersed in an adventure fantasy story where I was the main character and my actions had consequences. I loved it. I'm not saying other MMOs don't make you feel this way, but the feeling does get diluted very quickly. 
there isn't as much buyer's remorse in a hardcore game mode. Typically in modern MMOs, the goal is to speed through leveling quickly so that way you can reach end game. In a hardcore game mode, end game is the journey. It's the whole thing. Make it to max level without dying. That is the point. When leveling and questing is the game, your adventures are entirely customizable. You pick the trails you want to walk, the threads you want to pull. So even though I made a night elf druid, my friends and I decided that we wanted to follow some of the human storyline. And this guy decided that he wanted to be an exotic dancer in public areas. Uh, you gotta respect the hustle. Who's looting in the middle of combat? Not, I, I was, I'm just, my bad. I, I, I was, I really genuinely wasn't trying to. I, it's not me. My, it's immediately not me. To, not right, me. My oh, my bad, my bad. <laughs> yeah. are, we, are we killing or are we, are we I getting think I'm dying. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. Big heal coming in, big heal coming in, big heal coming in. He's busy looting! <laughs> oh my, Hunzi. I I'm, literally got to like 5% HP. I'm not, no, you're fine, you're fine, you're no, fine. No, I was 5% HP, I potted, I held. Somebody, who, oh, who's looting? <laughs> who's looting, bro? It's not me, bro. I'm it's telling you, bro. I'm, 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 you're, you're streaming. You're streaming. <laughs> <I> did, <laughs> did you know that we could see you? Something I have always loved about WoW is that insane dopamine hit when a really strong piece of loot oh. drops after trying to get it for weeks on end. And Thor <sighs> oh. Tips and Thorn. Holy oh. shit. Hey, good team. That sense of, pro of character progression is essential to an MMO. In hardcore, it's even more paramount because every little bit helps. You start off with the clothes on your back and a stick or something, and upgrades make you feel safer, like wrapping a warm, comfortable blanket around your shoulders. Oh, oh, oh. It dropped! It dropped! Oh. That warm blanket, though, will not last forever, as in order to keep progressing, you must do harder and harder content to get upgrades. So, so when we decided to challenge ourselves with what we thought would be a quick, easy stockades run, disaster struck. <laughs> Ripped it. We clear. Okay, we we clear. Wait, wait, wait. We clear side rooms first, and then we clear. Yeah. Okay. Oh shit! That is the boss. <laughs> oh, Dextrin. Oh, oh, and it feared me. It feared me. It feared me. Oh no! 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 Yeah. Oh, yes, 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 Get out, it's a running, run, 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 get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, run, get out, run, 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 just run, just run. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm running, I'm running. Oh, come on, boys, you got this. There's no oh, run, just get out of here. Ah, oh, come on, let me see. Oh, shit. God, I gotta go. Oh, I gotta go, I gotta go. Don't die, bro. Please get out. I'm, I'm almost out, I'm almost out, I'm almost out. Almost out. Go, 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 go. No, no. No, no. 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 No! This moment was so devastating that even my camera bricked for the rest of my stream, and I just didn't know how to recover. But that's okay. My friends and I are making another go of it at Hardcore Classic WoW on Mondays. I'm going to be streaming it. If you enjoyed this video and you thought that it was enjoyable or insightful i would love it if you swung by the stream or commented or gave this video a like just show your support in some way would really appreciate that but back to the topic at hand i mean gearing up and leveling in a hardcore environment is often stressful that stress however is what one keeps me aware of my surroundings and alive but two is what blossoms into that feeling of accomplishment and confidence when you achieve what you set out to do 
It is that same sense of accomplishment that creates lasting positive memories and feelings with the game. At the beginning of this video, I established the stakes of the hardcore game mode changing the MMO genre forever. I really do believe that, because if every MMO had a hardcore server for their players, it gives them something to do, something meaningful to accomplish as an alternative way to enjoy the game. As I played through Hardcore Classic WoW with my friends, I learned a few things. Emotional connection and investment were very integral to my enjoyment of a game. Meaningful progression was something I sorely missed in other game genres. And working hard at something, even if you fail, can be fulfilling. All of these things contributed immensely to my enjoyment of Hardcore Classic WoW. And they are the reason I believe every MMO, past, present, and future, should feature this mode as an option.